Good day, everybody. So today I'm working on making some trophies for a disc golf tournament that's coming up here pretty soon. Uh, my brother and sister-in-law put this on every year. So I'm uh, flattening this silver maple to get ready for engraving. So I put the shims in on both sides here and try to even it out so I'm not taking everything off of one side. So the cup side is up right now. That's the best way I've found for starting this. And then I will hot glue them to the melamine board and to the shims so they don't move while I run it through the planer. And of course Leo is out in the garage helping me because anywhere I go he needs to go. So I'm running all three boards through at the same time here and at first you're not taking much off but then as as time goes on uh, you start to move more and more from the face that is up. So here it's just a matter of uh, popping off the boards, make sure there's no hot glue. So the top side is completely flat. I'll be able to use that to register down when I do the other side to flatten the other side. This part here, I'm just running them through one at a time, but then I adjust down and they'll end up all being the same thickness in the end. After this step, uh, there will be sanding. I do a 120 grit and 220 grit to prep for the engraving process. Next, I load the piece onto the engraver, make sure everything's nice and square. Um, and I check around the perimeter, make sure it's going to fit in there the way I want it to fit in there and then uh, start the engraving process. So it takes about two hours per engraving to, to do this. So it does take a little time, but the end result's pretty nice. And just some light sanding after that, and it's ready to apply the finish, and um, you'll have the finished product. Thanks, everybody, for stopping in. Until next time, be safe, brothers and sisters.